So right now, we're gonna go test this thing out and see how it works. So time for the unboxing. We're gonna open it up. It's got a plastic seal on it. These things are tricky. Oh, there I got it. I beat it. And diamonds. So. Information there. Okay, so we got the instructions here. I'm gonna follow these instructions to make sure I don't goop this thing up. Oh, well, thank goodness this thing's already put together. I could have done that. We got these three pieces here, and from looking at the instructions, it looks like we need to screw this one into this one, and then this one into that one like so, and then the oh, and then the spin broom itself. We take the final piece, and it says to shove it in there. Okay, I think it's in there. I've got some Sun Chips and I've got some Cheerios and I've got them all up all over this floor and I've got them up inside that baseboard there. This thing picked up everything clean. So we push the one touch button and we'll take a look inside of here. And yep, you can see it is full of chips, it's full of sun chips and cereal. So now I'm just gonna empty it. I'm gonna do the one touch right over the trash bin, see how well that works. So push the one touch, popped right open. And that emptied out pretty good. It cleaned pretty good. So that's pretty empty. And it snapped right back shut. And it comes with this little doohickey here. And it says to clean the brush out with that. But this brush isn't really dirty enough to do that yet, so we don't really need it right now, but it's got that just in case. Okay, so this thing worked pretty good on dry items. Now we're gonna test it out and see if it does pick up wetness. I'm gonna pour a little water on the floor, we'll run it across the water and see if it picks it up at all. And it does not work on wet surfaces. It says it works says it works on wet. This does not work on wet surfaces. It's not picking up at all. As a matter of fact, the spin the spin brooms won't even work on the wet at all. So not bad at picking up dry items. As a matter of fact, it's excellent at picking up dry items, but on this wet floor, it doesn't seem to do much at all. It doesn't pick up the wet and it just slides right across without the uh, without the broom spinning. Uh, it's like it keeps the it's like it's lubricates and keeps the brooms from spinning. So that's a big no to wet messes. It does not clean up wet messes, or at least it didn't for me on a uh, hardwood laminate floor. Okay, so that worked pretty good. These things sell for around $10. So in my opinion, for $10, you know, I don't know if you'd expect a whole lot, but this thing worked pretty good for a $10 item. It picks up the dirt. I don't know about wet messes, how well it was at that. Like it says on the box, it picks up dirt, pet hair, and cereal. 
and I'm imagining it picks up a lot of other items that are have the consistency of dirt, pet hair, and cereal. Uh, with water, it's not so great, we learned, but this item is well worth the money for $10. It's something you can stick in the utility room and just bust this thing out anytime you need to clean up a quick mess. Somebody dropped some chips on the floor, you know, the dog's, uh, you know, you've got a shedding dog and there's pet hair all over the floor. Just run this thing over it, it'll pick it up. So hey everybody, I wanna thank you so much for watching this review today. If you learned anything and if you enjoyed this video, please remember to like, subscribe, comment, and share. I would really appreciate it. Thanks for watching and I look forward to seeing you come back for more of my Ass Seen on TV reviews. And now for the bad dad joke of the day. You know why you shouldn't buy anything made out of Velcro? Cause it's a total rip off. <laughs> hey, where are you going? You haven't clicked the subscribe button yet. Click the subscribe button and come back for more of my review videos. Thanks for watching and God bless.